Hey, good morning. Let me go and eat this real quick. Ah. Welcome back, Don't Starve Adventures. Oh, I forgot to let this food up. Another glowberry. I don't need the glowberry right now. Or really ever, uh, at this rate. Because we're gonna go to Adventureland! What's up? Uh, let me see. Actually, let's go ahead and drop, uh... We'll go ahead and drop some more of these in here. I just, again, I saw, I think I have, like, infinite food here. And we're gonna be leaving to go to Adventure Mode, so we don't necessarily need to have a ton of food on us, right? Right, yeah, I think that's the case. Uh, we are gonna go upstairs and do a little bit of, not necessarily organization. I don't wanna, like, waste all of our time doing a big ton of organization. We need to get some sticks together. Um, well, god, we hardly even need to do that. So, I made a mistake. Um, you don't take your stuff with you <laughs> when you go to, uh, when you go through Maxwell's portal. Uh, that was my fault. I thought, I thought that was the case. I just misremembered. I actually don't know where that is that you get to take, like, a couple things. Maybe that's in between levels once you access it, but according to the wiki, uh, you only go through with the, with, uh, you start with the items that you're supposed to spawn with. So I think I'll, I guess I'll spawn with the battle spear and, you know, whatever else. Um... Yeah, I'm excited to at least go and check it out. Uh, very, very, very soon. Did I leave the food down there? Son of a... It's fine, I just want to go up here and put all this crap down. Let's see, I can make a whole lot more food. I got like a ton more food. God, this monster meat is just ridiculous how many of these I have. Um, let me go and actually grab the monster meat and these very... Oh, I can't do that. Jesus. I was gonna make some food for enough, enough food for this episode, <laughs> pretty much. Uh, let's see, I put the hound's teeth in here. Bone shards and the hound's teeth. Good, 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 good. I got ashes. Ashes you know, with wood. Um, oops, uh, wood. There we go. And I could put that wood in there. Uh, the pan flute. Jesus, Max, I have fucking pan flutes. <laughs> I've never once used it. Let's just get rid of the damn thing. Uh, <laughs> I just look at the the ground. I'll, I'll figure it out, alright? Uh, I just, I just never, I just never put any fucking thought into it. Literally zero thought. Um, let me see. I still have tons of wood left over. Let me see. I think I have a, um, a little bit of room in. First, let's go and drop this nitro in here with the stone. That makes sense. Good. And then over here. See, we're getting, we're somewhat organized already. Look at that. Let me see. Sticks. We have plenty of, you know, we have plenty of sticks. We're not doing sticks. Uh, I do want to figure out what the hell to do with broken shell. Um, I believe I might be able to build something, perhaps, maybe, eventually. Let's go look at, uh, uh, like, maybe survival stuff, like armor and whatnot. Let's see. Hand bat, morning star. Wow. Morning. Oh, man, only one of those things? Oh, and I dropped one, too. Uh, morning light for a nighttime fight. Oh, how interesting. Hmm. Um, marble suit. Uh, you, you know, I did say I was going to build a ton of that, and, uh, I am still going to make a ton of it. <laughs> Just not right now. Uh, see, sleep dart. So, reeds. Right, that's right. Reeds was the other thing that we needed to pick up a ton of, eventually. Blow dart. Yeah, because we need to get, yeah, you know, get all that stuff together. Be mine. Tooth trap. Scale mail. Ooh. Oh, I don't have whatever that is. Uh, our fire. Oh, fiery. Yeah, never mind. I know what that is. Um, blow your enemy away. Cool. Man, it's all kind. There's so many things. It's crazy. It's really, it's crazy to me. It's just like, wow. Like, I, I, I've played so much of this game yet. Still, somehow, there's so much of it that I've yet not even, I basically not even scratched the surface. I mean, I've not made, you know, so many of these things, like, ever. Ever. Like, what is a siesta lean to? I mean, obviously, I know what it is, but, <laughs> like, jeez. Uh, small capacity, but keeps things fresh. Oh, wow. That's like a cat butt, isn't it? Isn't that like a cat tail? The raccoon things? Huh. Anyways, um, let me see. Let me go up to, let me go to this, talk to this guy here. See if there's anything in here that I can make. Again, looking for something that you use with the shells. I might have to look that up some other time. Yeah, 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 because it's all the same stuff, really. Marble suit. Let me see. Oh, and hounds. Look at that. We have a hounds coming again. Wow. Um, let's just make the let's just make the meat. Let's just make the food. Uh, and then I'm not terribly worried about. And this comes. There's no surprise probably to anybody. Oh, I gotta rub shit on those things. Fuck. Um, yeah, I'm not. I'm not terribly worried about going through and making a whole bunch of uh, uh making myself a whole bunch of uh, or organizing my inventory. I feel like I'm just okay with that. I don't need to. You gotta get ready to attack here. Oh god, okay, okay, yeah, 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 you come over here, come over here. Come over here, come over here, come over here, come over here, come over all the way down, all the way down. No, 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 come on, Chester, move, 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 good, 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 good. Catch him. There we go. Yeah, I could, I'm not worried about it. <laughs> well, I guess I pick up the meat. Don't stand in the fire, Chester, please. Please, please, Chester. Get the rest of this. 
And then it's gonna put back on this. All right, so I got some poop in my pocket here. Did I just pick some up? Oh, no, no. I was looking at it, I didn't put it on. Fertilized. Bam. I mean, I should have a... Oh, there's... I was going to say, wait a minute, I can still hear it. <laughs> there we go. Uh-huh. 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 Yep, yep, yep. Let's see. Seeds. More guano. We got some poop. Lots of poop. Um, in here. Uh, in, oh, shit. We're getting kind of organized. Just, just, just kind of. Kind of. We're getting there. We're getting there. Instead of sitting here spending an entire day to do it, we'll just try to be more mindful of our, uh, of our organization skills. There we go. It has ceased to, ceased raining. Okay, we'll put that back in here. Oh, man. Okay, now we gotta make a ton of food. Let's see, we're gonna cook. And then one, two, three, boop. Get that guy going. I should make another damn crock pot, really. What do I need for that? Uh, charcoal, stone, and... Okay, I have charcoal. Uh, I believe in here at the wood, right? Uh, that would be the place to put it, but... Uh, maybe it's somewhere else. Yeah, here it is. By the time I build it, I'm gonna be done with this. <laughs> One, two, three. Man, meatballs. Just, just meatballs. Just, she's just like, not, not worried at all about eating the same damn thing every single day. I love it. I'm so glad there's not some kind of mechanic where, like, the food, like, they get tired of the food over some amount of time. <laughs> you try to feed it. Like the pigs. You can only feed the pigs a handful, like, three times per day. Imagine that. Imagine, like, you can't <laughs> feed any more than, uh, feed them anymore a couple times with the same, the same type of food. You have to have, like, a, a variety of things. Actually, wait, isn't there, isn't there a character that's kind of like that? There's, like, a chef character or something. Um... Uh, let's see, let's go ahead and drop this in here. And let's go ahead and make our... I made enough for two, by the way. Figured I'd just slap it on here. Okay, and then we'll go ahead and make some more. And then I need one more of something as filler, which I think the ice can be filler, obviously. Uh, let's not take the whole thing, because it's already kind of... We'll just take just the one. Just the one that I need. So, but one. Boop. Actually, no. Uh, we need a bunch. Let's put the whole thing in there. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and make this. One, two, three, two, 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 two. good. And then, boop. And there we cook. That should do the trick. And the same thing. This is something like icy meatballs or something. Is that going to last for the next couple seconds? Yeah, it should. Mm-hmm. There you go. <laughs> uh, let's see. No more meat, but we could always go... Oh, there's berries on the ground. Oh, man. I guess I dropped them or something? I don't know. Let's take this. We're just gonna cook up a whole bunch of meat. A whole bunch of... meatballs. It's gonna be loaded on meatballs. I should just go and store all these here. Yeah. I thought I was gonna be saving this ice, but I mean, we're already we're like mid fall right now. So by what by episode or by um, day like ninety somewhere between ninety and one hundred, we're gonna be sitting in uh, in ice again. So no point in keeping stale ice around when we have fresh ice right around the corner. There we go. Now we can cook a ton of stuff super fast. I don't know why I didn't do this before. I mean, I, I am always talking about how I have so much food, but a lot of it is pretty much uncooked. So, this is good because we'll get all this stuff in, we'll put it in the ice box, and then we'll come back. We'll go to adventure mode, and then when we die, we can come back and basically recuperate. <laughs> we can come back and recuperate, and then, uh... And then, yeah, you know, we just, uh... <laughs> we'll just try it again, I guess. <laughs> do, 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 do. My sanity should be awesome right now because cooking is so relaxing. Seriously, Clay, I have everything. Every, I should get like two points of sanity per. That way I can sit here and cook and just be happy and blah 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 blah. But nope, 
Not the case. Alright, I'm just gonna use all the ice. Fuck it. Seriously, don't need ice for anything else right now. Let's see. Is there a... Uh, I believe I can use... There we go. I knew there was... <laughs> I saw them floating around back there. <laughs> you can't hide from me. Let's see. Boop. And then... Da, da, do. That's an odd mix to make meatballs, but, you know, meatballs is basically just like, uh, just hamburger meat that you just basically shove whatever you want into. So, I suppose it's not that far-fetched of a concept that, uh, you can just throw, you know, whatever you want <laughs> into it. They dry. How I long for a feast. There we go. And there, yeah, we'll basically just dry the rest. Cool. Now we have, like, <laughs> wow. <laughs> we have so much food. <laughs> Let's eat that. We could just uh, eat to top off our sanity if we wanted to. Uh, let's see. Nah, we won't do that. It's kind of a, it's like a super waste, actually. Let's go ahead and take... Um, this is going to last longer than the uh, jerky, which, by the way, that jerky just turned. Let's go ahead and grab that. Like that. And... Did it, oh, where's my thing at? There we go. Oh, just look at that. It just went stale. As I was looking at it. There we go. You have five monster meats. I could just take that with me right now. Oh, but that's actually, that's like fresh monster meat, though. We should, or jerky. We should take this. Yep. Good. Yeah, sanity. I know. I know my sanity. Let's see. Chester, do you have anything in you? Oh, that's right. You do have a bunch of useful things. Uh, first, let's go ahead and go. We'll put this in the charcoal bin. Damn it. Charcoal bin. Uh, or sorry, the uh, this bin. And then uh, the hound's tooth. I, got, I did a slot on here. Yep, cool. Or the uh, stinger, rather. Sorry. Um, yeah, the shells. Again, I'm just like kind of. I don't know. Uh, let's go ahead and grab. <clears throat> just kind of getting things ready. We are we're, we're going on an adventure, and I'm kind of a little, a little nervous about it. Cause I gotta do good. <laughs> I gotta do good, man. Right? I gotta do well. Uh, let's see. Du -du 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 -du. I'm actually getting to the point where I probably need another chest. Chester, my sir. Let me take this from you. Take. I don't know, I'll take that. I'll leave that. I'll take the hammer. God, we'll just leave the fucking hammer. We'll take the hammer. <laughs> I did say I was gonna go pick up a bunch of floor and move it, but that's not gonna happen right now. Um, let's see. So in here, we're gonna put in our, uh, evil sword. The darkness is sword. And let's see I have a helm, I have an extra helm. I'm pretty good. I'm, I'm good on basic resources. I'm basically good to go now to uh adventure land. But we can't do it yet. We can't do it yet. Can't do it yet. Monday. Monday, 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 Monday. Come here. Come here, come here, come here, folks. Come on, oh, come on. Come on. There we go. There you go. Okay. I'll just toss it in here. Let's see. Store. <sighs> Alright, so Chester can just stay here, I think, for now. I don't necessarily need all this. I'll take this, though, just in case I pick up some floor while I'm out. <laughs> uh, oh, and the broken shell. Yeah, I don't know what to do with that yet. I didn't look that up, so. No, I'm not going to look it up right now. And the, hand, the gears could probably stay as well. It's going to be make another fridge maybe some other time. Uh, and the Chester can stay. So there you go. All my, all my stays. All in one place. And I'm leaving. <laughs> I'm out of here. Let's see. Where to do what to go. We have one tiny chunk we've not yet explored right there, and that will pretty much complete. I mean, there's like this area here, but we explored that and then the game like crashed and rolled back, so that doesn't really count. Um, we could probably go up there, explore that, and then just make our way over to the portal and just park it. I mean, I have a fire right next to the damn touchstone that's right there, so. So yeah, that's not too bad. We can do that. Nope, we'll wait for that save, I guess. Na 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 do 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 Yeah, a little bit of exploration. And then we get. Let me see if all this road wow this road all the way up. Cool. We'll probably sleep maybe right on the edge, and then uh we can turn around and Yeah. Let me go grab a little bit of grass on the way up. Just to pay for that rope I'm gonna make. <laughs> pay for that rope in that sleeping bag. There's a couple pieces of grass. 
And I did say I was gonna get some sticks. And I did say I was gonna get some sticks. I need them, so. Yeah, adventure mode, boy. So there's a couple of different levels that I recall. There's Archipelago, there's a uh, Game as a Foot, there's a Cold Reception, and there's like one more that could potentially be one of the first maps that you encounter. Um, just about all of them I feel like I could probably take, uh, even despite my rustiness, I feel, still feel like I could probably take um, take them on. Damn it, why, why, see, I, I picked the exact number that I needed and it still split the stack. Jerks. <laughs> Uh, yeah, so yeah, despite, despite my rustiness, I do feel like I am capable. I'm confident in that regard. It's like, yeah, I think, yeah, I've done it before, and I think I could probably do it again. The nice thing is, it's not a total 100% commitment where, you know, we're gonna go in and then I'm gonna lose, you know, everything. Uh, it's basically just go in and do as, do my best, and if I fail, then I just, I just get, kicked, get kicked out, and I have to just try again some other time. Not a bad deal, I think. We're gonna go to sleep here in a second. Sleep. Go to sleep. Uh, I was just gonna say, if winter starts soon, sooner than anticipated, um, let's go and just top our sanity off here. Hmm, or hunger rather. Because, okay, listen, if I go, into the portal and I come out and it's winter, which it shouldn't, obviously time shouldn't progress, but if I come out and it's on the verge of winter, I might be in trouble. No, I have, oh, I have the materials. I can make a pickaxe, then make a thermal stone, then make a fire. Never mind, I'm good. <laughs> Sorry. Small thought tangent that I immediately corrected, clearly. Well, let's pick up these reeds while we're over here. I would love to finalize this map to basically say, yes, I've explored every corner of this map. This is my world. I've done it all. But, uh, yeah, it might not happen. <laughs> Wait, hold on a second, what? Oh, it's a whole other side of this area, okay. Yeah, back off, okay. Wow. Nice big chunk of corner of, uh, nice big corner of, uh, stuff here. I have 40 sticks, so I'm good there. I did say I was going to stick farming, but that was when I thought I could take sticks with me. <laughs> Turns out I was wrong! Let's see, let's get the pitchfork out. There's some delicious floor right over here. Let's get it. Let me see. Dig. Dig. Not wrong against some checkered flooring for the... For the crib. There you go. And then the last one. Perfect. Oh, it's different. <laughs> of course it is. Carpeted flooring is different than checkered flooring. I, yeah, I guess for some reason I just figured, you know, it was the same thing, which of course that doesn't make any sense. It is different. Put that back on. Day 84. Put a pickaxe on me? Nope. Okay. I won't bother with this rock then. And then we'll go down here to the right. Clear this up. There's some evil flowers over there. There's something up there, actually. Oh, there's the tree. That, um... Evil tree thing over there. Whatever that is. <laughs> again. Again, I, I still find it amusing that it's like... I, I, I have fucking a thousand hours in this game. Maybe more. You got across like various platforms and I still have not learned everything. There's still so much. Which is great, which is part of the reason why I still really love playing. And I'm thrilled that you guys actually like watching. Cause yeah, it's just like it's just still it's still a game of discovery for me. Try to get my son into it. He wasn't interested. I'll, I'll, I'll give him a I d I didn't I didn't want to push it too hard. Basically just um I started playing it in front of him and he was like, oh what's that? And I was like, this game This is the hardest game in the world and Daddy's really good at it. I seriously told him that. Um so now he thinks that it's the hardest game in the world. Uh which I feel like is kind of intriguing to him. But the most important part is he thinks that I'm the best 
the best player in the world at it. <laughs> so that's good. That's that's good. If anything, uh, at least he'll recognize the skill. <laughs> he's he's young and highly impressionable, right? So so you wanna you wanna you know instill those uh, those thoughts in early, right? It's kind of like uh, like Inception. You plant the seed. Like I've even 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 like platformers, you know. Like I know I know I, I jokingly say when we play uh, platformers here on on this channel or you know wherever else on stream, jokingly say you know oh, the platformer master and all that stuff, right? So I tell Declan that that I'm the platformer master. That oh, I'm the best. Oh, it's a platformer. I'm the best. I'm the best at that. And so that way, as he gets older, he probably doesn't even know what a platformer is. But as it gets older, <laughs> eventually it'll it'll click and he'll be like, Oh yeah, my dad's really good at those games. See? See? That's it. I say I'm the master. And he'll be like, wow, yeah, my dad's the best at this. Because kids will believe that stuff. Oh man, let me just... There we go. Just start, let me just start a fight. Why not? Let me see over here. I don't really necessarily need any of these things. Definitely don't need a mess thing. I don't need any silk. I don't need any of that crap, so... We'll just go ahead and leave. All right, cool. Well, good. Got all that area cleaned up. That's actually it. Oh, <gasps> that's it. I mean, there's that chunk uh, upper right here. That little chunk right there. But um, again, we've already explored it once, and we just end up losing it on a save. So I'm not terribly worried about that. But yeah, wow, that's the uh, that's the entire map. Huh. Well. <laughs> Wigfrid has definitely proven to be quite formidable, uh, quite formid formidable a, uh, a character. She really truly has. Which is why, which is why I'm looking forward to jumping into adventure mode because so far I've been able to solve a lot of her problems by just finding a group of shit to fight up, to fight. <laughs> I'm just gonna beat these things up, it's totally fine. <laughs> I'm gonna make a sleeping bag anyways. I'm not gonna use it, I'm just gonna make it. Again, splitting my stacks. I know it pulls from the leftmost first, but... That's dumb. <laughs> I should pull from the smallest stack. That's something that's oh, it's always been like that. That's that's one of those, like, things that will just never change. How many stemmy is in this stack right here? One. Okay, I don't necessarily need the one. Uh, let's go ahead and make our way over to the portal. And then we'll do a little bit of, uh, whatever maintenance farming and stuff. Maybe we should put something near the portal for when I come out. No, we don't need that, because we're going to come back with all of our stuff. I'm being over, over cautious, aren't I? That teleporter there will take us there, so that'll save me a little bit of a trip then. Yeah, go, we'll go right in there. Not worried about sanity, necessarily. Or we could just go straight up. Explore that area, and wipe that part off the map, and then, uh... What is that right there? Oh, okay, I thought I saw something on the map. Yeah, and then, uh, and then we could jump in, and then we'll get there. Yeah, perfect. That'd be, I have, actually, that'd be perfect. I have the food. We could just walk through the night. We'll see what kind of night it is first. I think we're expecting a, um... I think we're expecting... <laughs> fucking cat. Uh, yeah, anyways, I believe we are expecting to get a, uh, uh, a full moon night sometime soon. Come on, moon. I don't want to sleep through another full moon. Unless I have to. Oh, wow, well, not even close. Wow, okay. I'm, like, way off then. So what do we do? I mean, yeah, we talked about this already, but still, the, the question still lingers. What do we do with Wigfrid? Like, do we do we just keep going until we build like a mega base and then just quit? <laughs> I know you guys have had suggestions, and I trust me, I'm weighing all of them very carefully. Uh, it's just a matter of like, what? I don't know what to do. <laughs> I just, I just don't know. Um, like if, if, if Wigfrid proves to be the character that I could potentially last forever with, which it's seeming like it, because again, the first set of seasons is the hardest because you're still preparing for the seasons, you know? 
Um, as time goes on, you end up getting more and more, uh, more and more stuff. And the more stuff you get, the more prepared you are, the more prepared you are, then the least likely you're going to die. Or, in this, in my case, die three times over. Which I've done before, but I was also ill-prepared. So, yeah. Hmm. We'll have to tackle that question another time. Let's see here. Yeah, let's make our way down. There's a swamp right there? Oh yeah, it's right around the border of the swamp here. I'm gonna eat. Stale at best. That was, oh, that was stale, sorry. That was, that was stale beast, my bad. Oh, that was not what I wanted. Is it weird? <laughs> I think I pushed down and right. Let's see, so I have five pieces of meat. So we got, we got, we brought just basically the perfect amount of meat we needed to uh, make our way to the portal. Albeit a little bit of a detour. Just a little bit. Oh man, look at all of these. That's gonna be a bitch to get through. We're just gonna walk, really. This is not that far. Yeah, it'll be a bitch to, to, to cleave through getting uh, materials from those beefalo. The more there are. Tentacles. Tentacles. Reeds. I do want to pick those up. We are going to need reeds eventually to make all kinds of other cool stuff. Maybe that's like the end game, right? Like I have to build everything. Everything. Which is going to be difficult, right? Yeah, end game. That's what I'm, that's what I'm, that's what I'm contemplating here. What is, what is end game with Wigfred? The, uh, the slayer. <laughs> Just cleaving through everything. Like it's nothing. Like it's nothing. Man, she's awesome. No issues whatsoever. How much wood do I have on me? I have an axe. Let's make some more. These are all fresh. Ready to, ready to be picked. Or chopped. I brought that stupid hammer. I think I brought that hammer because I wanted to drop it somewhere in the open world. Because that's, the, that's what I do. <laughs> Just hammers all over the place. Good. Yeah, we'll just get a few more here. No particular reason, just to basically kill, kill a little bit of time and maybe decorate the portal a little bit. <laughs> and then we'll replant these guys. There we go. Adventure mode, adventure mode, adventure mode! Yeah. I was going to pick all these dumb flowers. Instead of standing here and losing sanity. Bone shards over there, nice. There's some more right here. Come on. Evil flower. <laughs> Stay focused. Evil flower. Evil flower, let's go. Nope, nope. Yep. Again, not, not at all afraid to tank that sanity. Nice. This whole area. I wonder if I can set set fire to this whole area and just clear all these things out, make some charcoal. Probably not a bad idea, actually. I feel like there'd be a lot of residual damage done, though. Let me do this. Oh, I don't have an act or a fucking thing. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. I was gonna set the whole thing on fire, but whatever. So here's the other base I had set up. There's not a whole lot here. <laughs> As you can see, not a whole lot at all. Why are these sticks laying on the ground? I wonder why. All these things. What the hell happened over here? Oh, something must have come through. Something big must have come through and started smashing everything in bits. That's what it was. That's what it was. Okay, and let's go and eat some of these. So I'm going to be pretty low on food, actually, when I come back. Which is, you know, fine. What does it say? You are about to step into a long, arduous journey to find Maxwell. You will need to survive five worlds, each randomly generated to present a new challenge. Should you die, you will start back at this portal, but lose all your progress on the journey. Wow. Should we just go? Why not? 